to another episode of Project Teen. I'm Jessica with the Allen Public Library and today we're going to show you how to make plastic yarn. Now this is something that's a whole lot of fun if you know how to knit or crochet and if you don't know how, this is kind of a good thing to maybe get you motivated to learn. All you need for this project is a plastic bag that doesn't have any um, ribs or holes or tears and a pair of scissors. Okay, let's get started. Okay, the first thing you'll do is take your bag and lay it out as flat as you can. The little seams on the inside, just tuck them in and make them as straight and as nice as you can. And of course, make sure it doesn't have any uh, rips or holes or tears. Now what you'll do is you'll just fold it in half, try to make it as even as possible, and then we'll fold it again. This will kind of help to keep um, the cut straight so that you aren't having to cut a really long way. Okay, take your scissors and we're gonna cut off the handles. Now you can hang on to the handles. They make really good stuffing for other recycled projects. And we're also going to cut the bottom seam. Put that aside. Now we're going to cut this into strips. Um, depending on uh, how thick you cut them will kind of uh, let you know what you can make. One inch uh, cuts are really good for making tote bags and purses and things that you're going to handle a lot. Half an inch cuts are really good for more delicate things like lace or uh, jewelry. So now we are just going to cut these into strips. Okay, now we have them cut and now we can open them up. And as you can see, they make nice loops. Okay, now we're going to link the loops together. I got two different colored plastic bags so that you can kind of see how I do this a little bit better, but you can do any colors you want. Okay, the first thing you're going to do is place one over the other, just like that. Whichever loop is on bottom, you're going to pull it through the top loop and just kind of fold it over. Now, you're gonna take that same loop and link it underneath itself and pull gently. And it's going to make what is known as a lark's head knot. Now, you don't wanna pull this too hard because then um, it'll end up tearing the strips, but just kind of make sure it's nice and firm like that. And then you continue on again. I'll take another yellow one so you can see how it's done. Put that one underneath, the one that's underneath. Link over and then under itself and pull it through. And then just continue until you have enough to make a big ball of plastic yarn. Plastic bags come in all sorts of different colors, so you can end up making lots of really cool patterns. This one was made with one inch strips, and all you have to do is follow the uh, same crochet or knitting instructions that you normally do, except you'll be using the plastic yarn, and it's a great way to recycle. Be on the lookout for more Project Team videos. Thanks for watching.